there was a time there was a time where people used to sit there and put a injured ankle an injured knee injured back they used to put it in warm water with epsom salt because guess what it felt good that's why they used to sit there if you sprained your ankle there was a time in sports they would put your foot in warm a swollen foot they would put it in warm water and they would say when you go home do that and soak it in some epsom salt we know now that that actually causes the inflammation to be worse putting your sprained ankle an acute sprained ankle putting it in warm water it causes the body to increase metabolism it increases circulation circulation inflammation floods to that area it causes the inflammation to be actually worse but because the water is warm you got a different sensation going on through your nervous system that says oh this warm water feels good so we think that because the warm water feels good that it must be helping when actually it was doing the opposite it was making them worse so what we have going on right now is exactly what black lives matter does it's exactly what i see ministers do it's exactly what I see this CRT stuff do. It's exactly what I see any type of rhetoric that's trying to divide us based on our gender, our our race, our status, our financial, social, economic status. It is the same exact concept, folks. Yes, it feels good to sit there and see people, Black Lives Matter and Black Lives and we are all oh, our voices. Oh, it feels good to say CRT needs to be taught so we can show that America's sin and that, that yeah. It feels good and sounds good to hear that, right? But the reality is it's doing nothing more but keeping the situation worse and making you worse and keeping the situation inflamed. And you don't think that they know that they're doing that? You don't think that they know that they're doing that? They are purposely doing that to keep things inflamed. See, but the reality is this. We know that if you do have an acute injury, you make sure you do something to counter that inflammation. You put the foot or the ankle, you wrap it in ice because we know that ice decreases the inflammation. Ice actually decreases swelling. And on top of that, ice actually ends up getting so cold, it numbs the nerve and the nerve doesn't send a signal to the brain saying it is hurting down here. We know that's what ice does, right? So the ice in its physical form, when applied to inflammation, the truth is ice decreases inflammation. Ice decreases swelling. Ice ends up making that area feel numb because the nerve is numb and it's not sending a signal to the brain saying, hey, it's hurting down here. We apply that and you can physically see that this is what happened. That makes it indeed the truth. People that are speaking out right now against this critical race theory nonsense is the representation of what ice is. If someone, the person that came up with the concept that putting a injured part of your body in heat thought that it was better for you, they did that for two reasons that I'm coming up with. They did it out of ignorance because the person before them told them that's what you do. And the person before that person told them what to do. They did it out of ignorance and following that format or they purposely put your injured part of your body in the warm water because they knew it was going to keep you injured and keep you inflamed so you can forever be their patient as long as they want to keep you. What goes on right now, folks? The reason why this is being pushed like this is because the ones who are actually trying to be for this and actually supporting this and actually trying to say that this thing is indeed true, it needs to be done. One of two reasons. They're only saying it because the person in the, the, the 60s said it and the person in the 50s before the person in the 60s said it and the person in the 40s said it before the person in the 50s said it that the person for the 50s said it said it for the person in the 60s. They're doing it out of ignorance and because it's something that you're supposed to say and do or the other part of it is this. They are doing it because they know it's going to forever be an inflamed thing. And they're keeping you as an injured patient. So you would have to do nothing more than to rely on them. 
what is going on folks appreciate you guys watching do me a favor if you're trying to get to the next reaction video that i did after this video it's right here but if you're trying to get to my own personal stuff where i do a lot of comedy things to make you laugh can help brighten your day then you click right here all right and if you want to subscribe to this channel you forgot to get to know who i am first though right then you're going to click right here to lead you into this description make sure you hit the bell notifications to get notified anytime i post a video all right let peace